Dear Walita, why did you leave? I miss you. I always think how things would have been different if you would not passed away from cancer. You would have seen me graduate from community college. Remember how we talked about me finishing school and transferring to a university? I've accomplished it and I'm working on my dreams of becoming a professor. I blame myself for not finishing things fast enough. If only I could have focused on school, things would have been different. I could have paid for better medical treatment. It was so hard not having you around. You were the backbone of this family. You are the reason why I'm at the university. You were always on my ass about respecting women. You showed me what it meant to love your family. You were my abuelita Celia, my second mother. You always taught me it was our responsibility to take care of our family. You would always say, if we don't look out for each other, who will? In the streets. It's time to move, y'all. It's movement time. Who will? With those words in mind, I try to make you proud. My goal in this movement is to voice our opinions, abuelitas. I get frustrated when people don't want to wake up to the truth. Sometimes I want to give up, but then I remember that you've always been my biggest supporter. Therefore, I promise you today that I will never give up. And someday I hope to find a way to make this movement a success. I know that you will be here for me. In the streets. It's time to move, y'all. It's movement time.